Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, folks. The most important tool to reach 99th percentile, and you are ignorant of it, and you are ignoring it. And so, what is this? Uh, quite simply, mocks, nothing else. Yeah, we at Two Eye are having a releasing a series of videos to kind of handhold you through the journey of the first few mocks. Only. Does a low percentile in mock cat exams mean I've lost my chance at I'm out? Definitely. You got one bad mock, you're done. You can't get into the top ten. Of course not, right? Everybody knows this, fine. So, uh, but it's probably a point worth reiterating. And so you can get. I've had students who've got absolutely monstrously bad mock scores and then gone on to score 99.6, 99.7. When I say monstrously bad, they've got zero or below zero in a section. And so, which is which is bad. By any metric, it is bad. And so, this stuff happens. Um, uh, mock scores are correlated with good performance, good preparation. No doubt about it. Especially good mocks from good providers. But um, uh, will there be bad mocks that are inexplicably bad, which are which are not there on any trend, just an anomalous figure, some randomness, some luck not going your way, some fatigue, some tricky paper. All of this very much possible. So one bad score, few bad scores, many bad scores. None of these mean that your door is shut. Lots of people have a series of bad score till they get the hang of it. After they get the hang of it, they have the odd bad score. And then when they are completely comfortable, the, the volatility in your score, the frequency of bad scores, all of those reduce. They fall down. It will happen, right? but almost. Every single person who's crack cat will tell you that they've had dropped some stinkers on the way, and have not even taken a serious cat. I've taken only fun cats and mock cats, and I've had some pretty. Uh, I don't want to use the word miserable, but kind of okayish, mediocre performances in, in the live mocks that I've done, and so just just embarrassing at a public level. Just to convey the point, I'm just trying to make the point that look. All of us are entitled to have a few bad days, and so and that will happen. Sometimes you have no explanation for why a bad day was a bad day. I'll be very happy if my bad day just reflected in poor mock score instead of some ill health or a bad argument or some me screaming at my kids. One mock score, I can handle it. So you need to reach a level of temperamental strength where you take the mock score in your stride and then get up and prepare for the next day.